with Steve Perillo talking cars today. If you're planning on an independent trip to Italy, there's a good chance you're interested in renting a car, or at least for part of your trip. I've got five tips for making your car rental experience a lot better. First, you don't need a car rental when you're in any of the Italian cities. Public transportation in the uh, cities are excellent, plus you'd have to pay for overnight parking at hotels, and many cities have very strict laws about driving through specific historical areas, so you could end up with a ticket. Wait to rent a car as you're leaving the city. Next, be sure you're prepared to drive. If you're a fearful driver at home, then Italy is not the place for you to learn to drive uh, casually. There are some challenges, tight streets, medieval towns, fast aggressive drivers on the autostrada or highway. Next, Italy isn't the place to learn how to drive a manual stick shift transmission. Most rental cars in Italy are manual, so if you've never driven a stick shift before, rent an automatic car. It'll cost a little bit more, but you'll be happy you did. When choosing the size of your rental, factor in how much luggage you have. Don't just think about the number of passengers. Finally, be sure to get an international driver permit before getting to Italy. In the US, you can get one through the American Automobile Association, or AAA. If in the unlikely event you're pulled over by an Italian cop, he or she might just ask for it. So if you're ready to rent a car in Italy, contact italyvacations.com. We'll take care of everything for you. Buon viaggio and happy driving.